Hi guys, welcome to part 17 of my challenge to uh, take on Cold Waters 1984 campaign with Skipjack. So let's see how we go in this campaign. Uh, currently picking up from uh, the last mission where I took on the, the massive Kirov class cruiser and sunk it. Um, so, without further ado, let's crack on to our next tasking. Got to get ourselves home to base first, just to rearm and repair. Although, I don't think I need any repairs, it's just to rearm and then go back out again. Okay, so there's the tally so far. 77 days at war, 22 missions accomplished, 3 capital ships sunk, and a load of other stuff there. Okay, enemy landing force, right. Uh, this is off the coast of Bergen. Right, let's check our loadout first. <coughs> yeah, put a few extra decoys in there and uh, load the torpedoes. <coughs> okay, just in position there. So the enemy task group will run into me. Our new contact bearing zero two one designated Sierra one. Rig ship for ultra quiet. Up scope. Okay, so we're within periscope detection range. Let's see if we can get a visual on these targets. Okay, there's one. Sonar new contact bearing zero six nine designated Sierra four. Okay, looks like a cash in. Con sonar new contact bearing zero six six designated Sierra five. Con sonar new contact bearing zero two. Turns for two knots. Okay. There's another warship over there. And uh, some merchants are a bit closer as well. So let's classify them all first. Con sonar master seven is classified as escort. Okay, that's an alligator. Master four. That'll be an alligator as, as well. Merchant. <coughs> Con sonar master three is classified as merchant. Con maneuvering, making turns for two. Okay, Puka. Okay, car a cruiser as well. Okay. <coughs> Another cash in. Sonar Master One is classified as escort. And finally, that's the trawler. Don't have to worry about that one. Okay. So that's the one I don't want to hit. Anything else I can hit, I don't want to hit that one. <clears throat> Con Sonar Master Six. Con Helm. Steady course. Okay, down periscope. Okay, I'm letting my decoys go first. Aye, sir. I'm only making two knots, so I'm not making a lot of sound. Just reload my decoys. Gonna put a couple of torpedoes into the uh, into the merchant group there, and then fire a couple off at the escorts as well. Con fire control, we've lost the wire. <laughs> Sod's law. That's the one I wanted to be wire guided, but I won't. Not to Okay, so load that tube again. Okay, and just fire one off over here. Cashing, yeah, and one at the cashing over there as well. 
So four tubes away. <coughs> Yeah, a bit of time Gone. compression. Okay. Look at this. Oh, there we go. There's been detection. It's probably just firing on the bearing though, to be honest. Yep, somebody's gone active. Okay, that one there should find the cash in on his own, that should be okay. <clears throat> Con, sonar, lost contact. Master, eight. Con, fire control, weapon countermeasure homing. Come left to three, three, eight. Helm, I. Can okay, I just adjust him my position there? <clears throat> There's a set at 65 torpedo coming down from the top of the screen, and I don't want to be in his uh, detection range. Not that I will be, because uh, the range on them very short, very short, and uh, somebody's uh, firing at me. <coughs> well, at least they're firing at where they think I am, actually. Here we go. This is an SN14. It's interesting as well how the uh, how the Russians or the Soviets, as they would have been known in the day, are the only navy to operate uh, missile dropped torpedoes. We never took that on in the West. I don't know why, but uh, there we go. There goes the torpedo. Con sonar lost contact. Master six. Last bearing zero one two. Contact breaking up. Okay. Thankfully, he's nowhere near me. Uh, target breaking up. Okay, so the cash in at the top there. Okay, what he's done, he's let off a uh, a countermeasure, which has fooled the torpedo. Fair enough. And my torpedo's got found the uh, the fishing boat. <laughs> Whoops, <laughs> didn't want to do that. Oh well, wasn't me. Honest. Right, okay, still got a mission to fight, so let's uh, crack on. <clears throat> Okay. Con sonar regained contact on master seven bearing zero seven seven. Okay, my wire guided torpedo has gone off his own, so he's finding another Con target. Room, two con sonar lost contact. Master two last bearing one. Okay, master one, two six, fine. That's uh, one of the cushions. That's fine. He's gone. <clears throat> okay, I'm about to uh, sink a merchant any moment by the looks of it. So that's right two, next. Zero. Six, nine, helm, aye. There goes my uh, wire guided torpedo wandering again. Aha. Uh -huh. Con, fire control, weapon countermeasure homing. In fact, I might let him just go for the, uh, go for the escort just because it'd be easier later. Don't want him closing down my position and dropping Con, torpedoes control, or depth charges fire. all over me. <clears throat> Passing 300 feet. Con sonar, noisemaker, bearing, zero, seven, two. Yep, sure sign there's an enemy warship there when you uh, you see and hear the uh, the decoy on the screen. Con, fire control, weapon acquired. That's the thing with the decoys as well, they make so much noise, it gives away the exact Con, position. Fire control, weapon acquired. So even if your, your sonar suite can't quite pick up the enemy target at that moment in time, as soon as, as soon as the decoy gets dropped, it's like, right, okay, that's that's where they are. Okay, so there's another escort down, two down out of four, but I've also got four merchants. Con, torpedo room, tube six ready. Aye, sir. Con fire control, we've lost the wire. Okay. Con fire control, we've lost the wire. 
Okay, so definitely a one more cash note there, and there's also a carver. But I want to focus as well on the merchants, so I've sent some torpedoes off towards those guys. Con, helm, steady course. They're easy targets anyway, they don't have any countermeasures, and they don't move very fast, so they don't think I don't think they'll avoid the torpedoes. Looks like I've got a cash in there bearing down on me, so I might have to alter uh, position of the uh, wire guided torpedo. There. Yep, I'm going to change that. Okay, looking at this, I'd say it's about 5,000 yards away, something like that. So to push my speed up to 15 knots as well, just in case there's anything else uh, coming sonar, my way. Any nasty surprises? Zero, five, four. Con, sonar, torpedo in the water. Like torpedo that, for example. Water. Okay. Zero, two, so I reckon that's probably an airdrop torpedo, probably from a helicopter. Yeah, a small torpedo. Yeah, that's airdropped. Okay. Yeah, helicopter overhead there. Con, Can you hear it? Sonar. Right. Last bearing, zero, four, zero, contact breaking up. Okay, Con, so... Room, two, five, ready. Cache number three's left, gone, zero. now just got to avoid Three, this torpedo. Turn, four, two, zero, not, maneuvering eye. I'd wish I was in deeper water, but oh well, it is what it is. Making turns for passing 400 feet. I've increased speed as well 20 knots, just give yourself a better chance and also uh, more chance of making knuckles at that speed as well. It's going to be close. Okay, so we've gone for maximum speed. There it is, gone underneath. But there's another one behind me as well, so we've got two after me. Yeah, when you've got a couple of torpedoes on you, you just need to keep changing depth all the time. Uh, keep making knuckles by uh, moving the rudder. Maximum left, maximum right, or maximum port, maximum, maximum starboard, whichever way you want to uh, call it. There we go, there was a knuckle. Basically just uh, like a sound anomaly in the water you can create with the rudder. We actually got to make a decent amount of speed to achieve that, so that's why I'm getting out of dodge. At flank speed. And a good thing of the skipjack as well, I find, in the 68 and in the 84 campaign, it is probably the most agile uh, submarine there is. It's not quite the fastest. Well, it's the fastest in the 68 campaign. It is the second fastest in the 84 campaign. Uh, but it is the most agile by far. So it's like a little sports car, really. So when you need to get out of a dodge quickly, it is, it is good for that purpose. Also, I just noticed that uh, enemy act active sonar ping was quite... Uh, was very clear on my screen, so he's probably Con, rather close. Steady course. Passing 100 feet. Make depth four five zero feet. Die by. Okay, depth in the kill has increased now, uh, so I'm gonna Con, drop my depth down to 500 four, feet, ready. or a little bit below 500. That Con, means I can four. run a maximum speed uh, without cavitating, which basically just means making noise. Formed. 
Con, knuckle formed. Keep making those knuckles. Come left to zero four zero. Helm there you go. There's a torpedo run out of fuel and destroyed. Rig shift for ultra quiet. Con sonar no longer cavitating. Come right to zero six one. Helm I. Con sonar switching to active search. Well, I've got active there because I want to. I want to locate this enemy quite quickly. Con sonar regained contact on master three bearing zero nine. And there's zero. somewhere where that yellow ping is. I don't have uh, on master four an exact target one, location. Zero, zero. Con sonar regained contact on master five bearing zero eight four. Con helm steady course. So in the middle of the screen there, one of my previously launched torpedoes has gone active, so that's searching for targets. So I'm sure it will find one of the merchants. Bit of time compression here, speed things up. Uh, Con sonar regained contact on master eight bearing zero four five. I've got to send that as a shallow search. Con sonar, switching the passive search. Okay, once passage now I've got range on him. Con sonar lost contact. Master three. Last bearing zero nine two. Contact breaking up. Okay, that's Con cool. Sonar, noise maker bearing zero five two. So by sending off those torpedoes earlier. They've basically gone and taken out two of the enemy merchants uh, for me without basically fire and forget, so I've done nothing there. So that's that's all good. And this is my my last uh, my last warship enemy. Gun, so fire control, weapon acquired. Con sonar, noise maker bearing zero five three. Con fire control, weapon acquired. That's trouble actually trying to uh, trying to use time compression when you when you when you're close to your enemy target because uh, all I want to do is sink it and get the level over. But uh, yeah, he drops a countermeasure and then all of a sudden you've got to re recalibrate. Oh, here we go. Fire control, weapon acquired. You know, not get him away from me now, mate. Con sonar, noise maker, bearing. Zero, five, zero. He's determined to evade, I'll give him that. Con, fire control, weapon acquired. Okay, send the sensors active. Terminal homing. Con, and there he is, he's gone. Master eight, last bearing, zero, four, eight, contact breaking up. Now, as I said, there's one merchant remaining, but to be honest with you, I've sunk three out of four, so there's no point continuing. I've won the mission. There we go, guys. Thanks for watching. Um, if anybody's having any trouble with the game and, and any any issues, any uh, yeah, any difficulties at all in completing levels or missions or whatever it is, drop me a comment, and um, I'll give you some help. Cheers. Thank you.